Hi fitness friends, today I have an upper body workout for you. This was written by our dear fitness friend Daniela, so if you like this workout make sure you leave it with a thumbs up and you let Daniela know what you liked in the comment section. For this workout the only things I'm going to be using is various dumbbell weights and my physio ball at the very end just for an incline, so you absolutely do not need a ball, but you definitely should have some dumbbells to challenge yourself throughout this workout. I do not have a warm up, so push pause, get your whole body warmed up and ready to work because although this is an upper body focus, you will be working your entire body. So make sure you're all warmed up and ready to go and let's get this upper body focus workout started. All right, I hope you are all warmed up and ready to go. We're gonna hit start right away on our first part. The way this part is set up is no rest Tabatas with cardio moves in between. So for the no rest Tabata, that's 20 seconds of a move, 10 seconds of a hold move, and we're doing four rounds of each move, okay? So eight rounds total, so four minutes of Tabata before we get a cardio move. If you don't understand what I'm saying, just do what I do. I'll let you know what's coming. 10 second countdown is started. We're beginning with a chest press and a chest press hold in the 10 seconds. So we have four rounds of that. I'm going to 24 pounds. So you get on your back or your bench or your ball. Let's go, chest presses. Straight up above your chest. Squeeze your chest at the top of that motion. So here you're holding it. Don't rest your arms on the ground if you're on the ground like me. You're holding it in a mid-range to lower position of a chest press. And presses again. This is round two. Hold it down there 10 seconds and then drop the weights for your push ups. Okay, get those weights out of your way. Flip it over. You got push ups. <laughs> you can do it. My chest is just on fire. Failure in the first set. So plank hold or push up hold, do what you can. Round two, chest to the ground. This is it. 
you're there, stay in that plank. Three, two, one. Oh, stretch it out. Our first cardio move is 10 explosive push-ups. So get those weights out of your way. And when you do an explosive push-up or a plyo push-up, you try to get both your hands and your feet off the ground. Here we go. We got 10. My chest is just on fire. It's like trembling. Take a minute, shake it out. Let's get 10, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh my goodness. Okay, next, Tabata. We have Tabata 2 as a reverse fly with a renegade rows in the 10 seconds. The last four rounds are bent rows and a shoulder blade squeeze together in the 10 seconds. So for the bent row, you're doing two bent rows, two arms at a time, and then in the 10 seconds, you're just holding it up there. I'm gonna go with 12 pounds, no, nine pounds. I'm going with nine pounds. Sounds like I know, but with these no rest tabatas, be prepared for failure. Reverse fly. Move it forward, fly it out. You're alternating rows, just like this. And flies, round two. Rows. Four, three, two, one. Double arm bent rows. At the 10 seconds, you're just keeping your elbows up and squeezing those shoulder blades together. Round. 
I'm sorry, you have one more round. <sighs> Wishful thinking. <laughs> Keep going, one more.
gonna drop my weights for my holds. Five, two, and one. Holding my arms straight out, no weights. This will even be a challenge for me at the end. Lateral raises. Stay with it. Three, two, get ready for a hold. Get them up. If you're holding your weights, keep them right up there. You got this. Lateral raises. Keep it going. Two and one, hold it out. You got one last set. Lateral raises. Ten seconds. Five, two, and hold it. Five seconds. Two and one. Awesome job. Okay, we have our cardio move of pike push-ups plus a double butt kicker. So while you're in pike, you jump both feet up at the same time and kick your butt. Pike push-up, you're using your shoulders. Here we go, you only have 10. Make sure your body stays straight and tight. That butt is up in the air. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No rest to bottom number four. We're doing bicep curls for the 20 seconds. In the 10 seconds, you hold at 90 and do an external rotation. We are pairing that with for the next four interval, the last four intervals, reverse grip push-ups and either a plank or push-up hold. So nine pounds. Guys, I sound really windy, but this is hard. If you're doing this with me, give me some love in the comments about my weight choices. Here we go. It's regular bicep curls, so palms out, elbows pinned to your body, you're squeezing up and down. Two. One, hold at 90, external rotation. Elbows stay pinned. Ready for curls again. Here we go. Down, all the way up. Make sure you're making that muscle. Squeeze it. Two. And one, hold at 90, external rotate. Bicep curls, round three. This should start to be really burning for you. If it isn't, you chose too light. Two. And one, rotate. One, two, 
one. Back to curls, last round. After this, you do the external rotation. Drop it down on top of your weights with your palms forward for the reverse grip push-ups. Working those biceps. Two, one, rotate it. Five seconds, and you're doing push-ups with your palms forward. This is gonna burn. So you're coming down with hands facing forward, using those biceps to push yourself back up. Hold plank or hold that reverse grip push up position. Push ups again. Last round coming up. One more. Ten. Set them down. Shake it out. Okay, we have a Tabata number five. We're doing triceps, of course. So kickbacks. I'm alternating arms, hinging forward, doing one and then the other, and then 
and the 10 second rest, I'm simply going to step back into a lunge and do presses. Okay, so I'll try to alternate legs that I step back with. That's the first four rounds. The second four rounds are tricep push up and then either tricep hold plank jacks or just plank jacks. <laughs> if your triceps are gone by that point, like mine will be, I'm just gonna do a plank hold and jacks. Okay, 10 seconds, sticking with my nines. Whew, these small muscle groups <laughs> just burn it out, especially with these time under tension techniques. Here we go, hinge forward, elbows up, kick it back, and alternate if you want to do it like I am. Or you can do double arm kickbacks. You can choose whatever you want. In the 10 seconds, I am pressing back with both arms. One, so I'm stepping back, pressing back. Back to two kickbacks. Tricep makers for this cardio move. <laughs> we are doing 20 press jacks. So I'm going to go with a 15 pound weight, hold it like a goblet, 
and press it straight out in front of me each time I jack. So one, two, like that for 20. Okay. After this, we have one more no rest Tabata before we move on to part two. So you are cruising through this workout. Stick with me, I know it's challenging. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Drop it down. Last no rest Tabata is chest flies with 10 second pulses or holds and then a wide row with one with the 10 second pulses so wide row you're hinging forward your weights are coming out wide okay up towards like your chest chest fly i'm going to go right on the ground and nine pounds just seems to be what i'm going with this for this workout so i'm sticking with that and I have to go on an angle so I have enough room for my chest flies. So make sure you have enough room. Get on your back. Weights are up above your chest. You can use your ball for this if you want more of a range of motion. Slight bend in your elbows. Squeeze it right above your chest. If chest flies hurt your shoulder, just do chest presses or a different variation of them, like a close grip chest press. So for the fly pulse, I'm sort of just bending my elbows and moving it up and down, making sure that I'm focusing on my chest muscles, making that movement. Round. 
pulse, 10 seconds. Three, two, one. You're done with no Tabata. Thank goodness, our cardio move for this set is 10 back bow burpees. So you jump down for a burpee, put your arms straight out in front of you, belly on the mat, do a back bow before you come back in for the push up and jump up. And we have 10. Let's do it. Hop it down, bend it down, back bow, jump it up. One, two, make sure you don't strain your neck. Keep your neck and back in line for these.
We're down to eight reps for the burpee. It's a burpee, hammer curl, shoulder press. Sticking with 12s. So push up at the bottom, hammer curl to a press at the top. One. Two. Three.
and I'm doing my tricep push-ups on top of my weights. Doing a double arm kickback for the kickbacks too. Here we go. One. Yeah. 